Hello. Okay, um. Do not ask me why I'm doing this when I'm doing another walkthrough. But I'm taking a break on Resident Evil 5 right now. And I'm kind of in the mood for Portal, so. I decided I should do a Portal 2 also. And the game is pretty short, so. I said, well, I might as well do it since, you know. Because since it's an awesome game. And since Portal 2 is coming out in a little bit, so. Might as well do this. Okay, like, like, unlike my other walkthroughs, I'm not gonna talk as much because this game is a very seclu secluded and very quiet uh, game, whatever. And I'm guessing you kind of just wanna hear what's going on in the game, you know. And so, yeah, I'm wasting time on the intro, so I think I'll just start the game. You'll hear me talk sometimes, but rarely. walkthrough um you might see me kind of like uh like you might you might be saying wow why isn't like is that really how you do it well there will be some there's like advantages whatever to get through some of the puzzles like you know cheating but i'm not using cheats or anything it's just another way to get through the puzzle so yeah if it seems a little too easy then yeah Please move quickly to the chamber lock, as the effects of prolonged exposure to the button are not part of this test. <laughs> is not part of any test protocol, but is an unintended side effect of the exercise material emancipation grip, which may, in semi-rare cases, emancipate dental fillings from tooth enamel and teeth. I think it's really annoying. Very good. You are now in possession of the Aperture Science Handheld Portal Device. With it, you can create your own portals. These intradimensional gates have proven to be completely safe. The device, however, has not. Do not touch the operational end of the device. Do not look directly at the operational end of the device. Do not submerge the device in liquid, even partially. 
Most importantly, under no circumstances should you. Please proceed to the chamber now. Well done. Remember, the aperture science bring your daughter to work day is the perfect time to have her tested. Welcome to test chamber four. You're doing quite well. Once again, excellent work. As part of a required test protocol, we will not monitor the next test chamber. You will be entirely on your own. Good luck. this um i might uh i might do the challenge maps but i don't know probably not as part of a required test protocol our previous statement suggesting that we would not monitor this chamber was an outright fabrication good job as part of a required test protocol we will stop enhancing the truth in three two we have added a consequence for failure. Any contact with the chamber floor will result in an unsatisfactory mark on your official testing record, followed by death. Good luck. Yeah, okay, see you later. 